dark, isn't it? I was going to do this before. <laughs> Some clown over the way there started letting fireworks off. She <laughs> bang, pop, crash, Harry. I don't know. Crazy. Anyway, we've had some water. I'm surprised they're letting fireworks off with water. Why do I keep going dark and light? Well, every time I wave my arms about, I go dark and light. I don't know. Anyway, you have to put up with it. I'm not technology minded. Um, <clears throat> with all this water about, my car got a good underneath washing today because I toddled off towards Ludlow this afternoon. I went to see my mate, Tim, the crafty beer guy. That's him, there. He's got a stall on Ludlow Buttercross with all his beer on. And I bought four beers. And I thought, which one to do first? Because they all look absolutely fantastic. So I thought I'll start with the smallest first. Now, Tim's there every Sunday until about five in the evening. So if you like your crafty beer and you're still, you're sort of in the Ludlow area, he's in Monmouth on Saturday, I think, but he's got a Facebook page. And um, crafty beer guy on Facebook, <clears throat> he's on there. So look him up, go and buy some beer off him. Because he's a good lad. You get a discount card if you buy enough. Yeah. Well, I've got one. Privileged. All right. Right. So what I did, I bought four off him, which I'm going to do four videos for over the next sort of few weeks or so. So I thought I'd start with the smallest first. This is... Um, <clears throat> oh. Where's he gone? Brass Castle Brewery. Never heard of them before. But they're in Yorkshire. Moulton in Yorkshire. So they can't be all that bad, can they? And this is called Bad Kitty. They think of names up for these beers. What's wrong with Newcastle Brown Ale or Boddington's Bitter? Bad Kitty Vanilla Porter. Now, I've had a vanilla porter before. Didn't think I was going to like it, and I did. So I'm going to try another one. 5.5% alcohol, this one. Uh, so we'll, we'll, we'll continue with the, the crafty beer theme and use the glass that he uh, provided for me. Let's hope he doesn't spurt all over the place. All right, here we go. Let's open it up. Well, hey. Mmm. Smells very, very nice. Oh, blimey. Oh, goodness sake. Oh, look at that. Do you want to flip inflate with that or what? I'm going to complain to straight trading standards. Nice creamy head, off white, way too big. <laughs> God, you can't get the staff, can you? The last time I did this, I've stopped the video and did another one. But I might do that. Definite hints of vanilla in there. Coffee as well, maybe. I wonder if I can suck that through the, uh, through the head. Let's see if we can go it. I can't be bothered to stop it. I'm going to, I'm, I've had enough now. It was a bad day yesterday. But good day today. Ooh. Mmm. That's different. Mmm. I'm not sure about that one. Hmm. Oh. It must be good if I'm going mmm and oh, mustn't it? Um, it's it's quite sharp. And uh, you know, here we go again. And I did get some through the head. So, <clears throat> yeah. I can't taste much of the vanilla in it. I'm getting a lot of the, the multi porter. For it we're getting a little bit of vanilla back taste but um but not a lot it's quite pleasant even through the froth and this is a glass not plastic like really watch out for another video we did one there and then on, on another beer let's give it another go let's see if i can get through this um through this uh, head Mmm, mmm, 
it's nice it's really nice that I'm getting the vanilla now the more I've tasted it I'm getting more of the vanilla flavor and that's really quite pleasant which I've never thought I'd hear myself say as regards you know ale and beer it's got to be you know hobgoblin or nothing <laughs> but then you live and learn don't you so I'm going to enjoy this once the uh, the froth settles down it's frothy man now if you know that <laughs> you're showing your age answers on a postcard or in, in the comments it's frothy man anyway I got it from the crafty beer guy and if you're on untapped as well the the app that rates the beer he's on there as the crafty beer guy Tim Whiting go see him I'll promote him as much as I can because he's a mate of mine and uh, he, he sells me beer so can't go wrong and he likes decent music because he likes out of order can't be bad can it all right folks enjoy the rest of your weekend i will see you all very soon with the other cans that are bought when well, I'll, I'll show you them when uh, as and when i do them and um i better go and find some tea all right can't be bothered see you all soon folks have a good evening and the finger of doom Is there. <laughs> Behave, drink responsibly, and if you don't, send it to me. Take care.